to a new video. So today's videos are kind of random and I wasn't necessarily planning to film one of these but I feel like it needs done. And I don't know if you can tell from the messy background of my bookshelves, this is the neatest area which is why I'm filming in front of it. But I have boxed up a lot of my books and moved a lot of books so I thought I would do a mini bookshelf reorganisation because I need to do one. They're messy, I've accumulated a lot of books from secondhand bookshops recently and they just need a home. So all the books that are on the very very top of my bookshelf I have all boxed up and I've moved all of my Sarah J Maas books along there and some Cassandra Clare ones and then the rest of my shelves are just needing swapped around, books need to be put away and it's just a whole mess and I thought I would just do a little reorganisation video because I know people love watching these because I do. <laughs> so yeah, I thought why not, I may as well film it. Yeah, I have all of my new books to try and find a home for and I just kind of want a reorganisation. I get really bored of the same background and stuff so I just want to switch all of this around. I want to move it about and we'll see how it goes. So this isn't going to be the best reorganisation video and I'm definitely not emptying my entire shelves because I am far too lazy for that but I am going to try and move everything around, switch it up and just play around with it and see how I like. So if you would like to see me reorganise my bookshelves then please watch in this video and yeah let's just get straight on with it. Okay so as you can see I have all of those books along the top there so I'm just going to leave those there but this is how messy my shelves are. So I just have like random books here and like here where I've moved stuff a bit and then I have like a big stack there, big stack there. I also have another stack there and then more all here and more down on the other bookshelf. So they're really messy and just need a good organising and then I do, I'm exposing myself with how messy my room is right now. Um, but anyways, over here this book cart is overflowing and it just really really needs organising and I need to put some of these books onto my shelves so I want to sort through those. But basically I just have too many books and not enough space and this is bearing in mind that I currently have probably 15 boxes of books already that I've taken off of my bookshelves so yeah I thought I would just organise it and film it and I don't have a plan, I don't know what I'm going to do but let's just go with it and see how it turns out. I think I'm going to leave these as they are because I have nowhere else for them but anyways yeah let's just get doing things, don't know why I'm doing this but yeah let's just get into it. so hungry so I've managed to do quite a bit and I did end up boxing up like another four boxes of books I still don't have enough room um but I think for now I'm just gonna go make some dinner 
and get a drink and just have a break because I'm sweating and I've done a lot and I'm getting a headache but I'll show you guys what it looks like so far okay so this is how it's looking at the moment I'm not 100% happy with it but at the same time like I'm not too bothered like I'll be boxing them all up soon anyways um but this is like how it's looking so I think all of these or most of these I'm gonna box up um and then probably these and then I still have this shelf to put something on so I'm probably gonna move those two and then I've cleared a little bit of space on the shelf so yeah this is like how it's looking at the moment um so I've boxed like a lot up there and then there's some more I've boxed um so basically I've kind of just shimmied it around um I have like my vintagey antique box here and then like some classics and poetry and then more like classics and stuff and then I have like my Greek mythology shelf and like Oxford Library editions and then some Shakespeare here and then I've got like all my mythology, Egyptology, witchcraft kind of books there, some non-fiction and then general fiction and then all the bottoms like fancy romance random um, and then I still have my thrillers there but I might move them and then my pretty editions there so yeah it's looking okay but not exactly how I want it but it will do for now I'm gonna have a break and then I'll continue, so yeah. <laughs> So, as you can see, I've had to tie my hair up because I got that warm doing it. So, I did continue organising my bookshelves. I didn't do all of it on camera because it was a lot of moving about and I couldn't really fit it in one shot. But I'm pretty happy with how they look. I ended up boxing up a lot more books. So, I have removed tons from my shelves and they're just going to sit in storage just because I didn't have enough room. I do have a tiny bit of room left over now. So, if I get some new books... I'll be able to like put them somewhere but yeah it looks good and I managed to fit like a mini shelf for Jamie because Jamie's finally gotten into reading and he slowly got a little book collection growing so he has a little shelf which is quite cute and I also tidied up my desk space and kind of reorganized that and I just like how it looks it looks cute so yeah I will like show you guys that now <laughs> the shelves look after this mini reorganization i will be doing a very big full reorganization video sometime in july or june so look out for that because it's gonna be exciting and very different and yeah that's all i'm gonna say but yeah i hope you enjoyed this mini reorganization video anyways i'm so happy that i managed to finally get this done because my room has been a mess of piles of books for the last month or two now so i feel very very relieved that it's done but i hope that you guys did enjoy this video if you did please do give this video a big thumbs up and if you made it to the end please do leave a little heart emoji or any emoji that you would like and let me know when you last reorganize your bookshelves do you reorganize your bookshelves quite often do you do it like once a year once a month let me know in the comments how often you do your bookshelves i'd just be really interested to know yeah i hope that you guys did like this video if you would like any extra content from me i do have a patreon where i upload extra videos and reading vlogs life updates 
behind the scenes photos you can get early access to a lot of my videos and we also have a discord and we do a monthly live show on buddy read as well so if you are interested in any of those things i would absolutely love to have you there but yes thank you so much for watching this video i hope you're all safe and well hope you're reading a lot of good books and i'll see you in the next one bye